from the last video in Levy, we hit the road to Kapdalis, Sweden, the true destination of this camp and where we'll be pitched up for the next weeks before Gdansk. Good time. Another pair of skis to go to the graveyard. <laughs> Been in Cub Dallas for a few days now already. Kick this week's video off. In the ski room, Alan doing some work on my boots. The new ones trying to get them feeling a little bit more like my old boots. <sighs> Always a lot of tinkering going on. Had a little ski in them today and not quite right yet. Let's go have a look. The body jai bomb. It's all right. It's uh, we're getting there. Could have been a lot worse. We haven't found the uh, the guy or the girl. Um, it was a hit and run, so we don't we don't know. Could have been on the phone driving. Could have been drink driving, or could have just fled in sheer panic. So yeah, don't drive on the phone because it might have been that. Shrink the toes in a bit. Ground the heel. Change. Oh, not anything there. Changed to the boot boards in my old boots just because there was a slight difference. And all the small things definitely made that new boot feel better. So we'll give that a go tomorrow. Now there's one more port of call. It's time. It's time. Just doing some email. To cut David's mullet. Uh, sorry. <laughs> you what? I think you should do a poll. What? We have three different hairstyles. Dave. Just the mullet, okay. the mohawk, or the Dave Ryden hairstyle <laughs> for Lauren. You know what I've been told about the mohawk? That's been absolute veto. Got, I'm getting there, dumped if I have a mohawk. The issue is with the poll, we're doing this discreetly. So yeah, Cathy's not going to know. This is a surprise. <laughs> this is a surprise, mother. Do a poll in the restaurant. Shut it, David! Restaurant poll. No, we're poll. just doing it. What should you do? What do you no, want? we should do a poll on your hair. We can't do much with mine. Can't get more than short back and sides and short on top. You can definitely cut this into a mullet. We could just picture this, picture right. this. Nice, like, diagonal. Yeah, and, and then some racing lines. Who wants, wants to see it? Who wants to see lines? racing Same. stripes? Whoosh. First of November, racing. My mum's a hairdresser. 17 days until race day. That means... We need to start getting fast. We panic! And that means mullet, or you can panic. <laughs> I'll go, I'll go for panic. <laughs> mullet and moustache. Dave, you know you want to do it. Luckily, Dave's didn't take too long and we could move on and get down to business. Let's go for a modest mullet to start. We can always get more aggressive and dirty later on in the season. to another pretty amazing sunrise this morning. You know what, I'm actually just not going to film because this is the earliest you've ever been. Stupid. <laughs> so I'm just going to put the camera away. There's no point filming unless you're late Dave. Dave's on strike after me silencing him. Can't defend myself. It's a dictatorship on this vlog Dave, I'm afraid. Well he is. It is <laughs>
real behind the scenes here. Every run's on video. Every run's got to be named, categorised, ordered. Yeah. Welcome to Behind, Behind the Brits. All my ski video is available over on my Patreon page, along with more behind the scenes, ski analysis, and other in-depth videos. So be sure to head over there and check it out. The link is in the description. I lost the audio to this clip for some reason, but Billy had forgotten about some eggs he'd left in his pocket for a snack. And yeah, they weren't hard boiled. So it got pretty messy and didn't smell that great. And obviously being part of this team, you've got to have your wits about you and know that that will be coming your way. Mixing it up today. We've only got three lines, so we're testing foot agility. I could definitely beat Reposo at this. Rock, paper, scissors, sheep. Rock, paper, scissors, sheep. Ah, sheep. One, two. Uh, you, have to, you have to take away two. You gave me an extra one. Extra two. You didn't get that last one. No, you got two, you got two extras where you count the same the one twice. One, no, but you got two extras yeah, in I there. Yeah, I got the last one, you didn't. You didn't get the last one and you had two extras. No, definitely not It was two. two. I said one. It was two, so I can't, I, I, it wasn't. I can look back on this. Are we looking better here? Nine, 12, 13, one, two, two. That's two, David, and you know it. But, I know I missed two. <laughs> <laughs> he, he's dead! <laughs> See, right. This is why he wanted to count. He was, he was counting, I, and I thought I got the last one. Wait, are you saying we need to see this? We need to see it, Billy. No. You can't do me dirty every episode. <laughs> 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 no, Ooh, didn't get it. Didn't, didn't get, get it. it. Ah. Did not get that. Didn't get it. <laughs> <laughs> Equal last. <laughs> no, tie second. That's true. Podium. That's podium. Yeah, these two had a practice at this yesterday. It's my right. first time. Scores on the 50 course. points for Good Billy Major. Not oh, Griffin, though. 42 no, all, 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 all day. for Dave. <laughs> 42 for me. You're a Slytherin. <laughs> I'm not a Slytherin. For choosing how I would, I would be you. put straight in Gryffindor. Sporty, honest, not the <laughs> mega brains, but all right. I'd be freaking. <laughs> Why he says honest when he just tried to nab another extra one. Well, that's just because I, I, <laughs> right, he was shipping I, me one out. Right, okay, let's, let's just get on with it. Come on, Dave. This morning, we're training on Tristan's mistress. We've been watching them build this guy uh, pretty much since we got here. That's where we're skiing today. I think we've got, we've got us. AJ and Popov. Not sure if Armand is training with us today, but pretty excited to have a go on this new site.
another pair of skis to go to the graveyard. Where is it? Here we go. That guy. Edge has come off. Maybe at uh, this side you can get a... Yeah, it shouldn't be sticking out like that. Used them so much, the edge got so thin, and now it's popped. That was, that was the first run. So I had to sacrifice another pair to finish the warm up. Bit of a head scratcher for me today. Just was quite a long way off the pace. Didn't have a bad feeling though. Thought maybe it was the new boot. Wasn't quite getting what I wanted from it. Because I had a good feeling of what we'd done to the boot, but then I'm like, oh, maybe it's not quite giving me enough in the ski. Changed the boot. Definitely got more from it, but times didn't improve. Um, so I felt like I was trying really hard, but didn't quite get anywhere with it. <sighs> yeah, those ones tough to deal with so uh, I'm gonna have to look at the video see where we're at <sighs> the good thing is new days means new chances to figure things out and there's not a shortage of that up here each day a little step forward figuring out equipment and what I need to be doing on this snow and slope So that is it for this week's video. If you enjoyed it, head down, hit the like button, subscribe, and if you're interested in more content, head over to my Patreon page where I'm gonna be posting some more in-depth stuff. Stay tuned for next week. We'll still be here up in Sweden, but race day is getting closer. Just over a week left to go. See you next week. Hello, my name's Lot Rose. My girlfriend's coming today, and I'm very excited. Um, I've done a mullet. Um, I hope she likes it. It's gonna be a surprise mullet. She doesn't know I've done it here. And um, really looking forward to seeing her. I love her lots, lots.